Welcome to Reddit Reader. People who have experienced and or mastered lucid dreaming. What was the first thing you did once you realized you were in a dream? A door-to-door -door salesman tried to sell me a suitcase full of loose SpaghettiOs. I said, no thanks, I've got plenty. And I popped my car trunk open to show him that it was, indeed, filled to the brim with SpaghettiOs. I really wanted to jump off a tower with a parachute for some reason, and the parachute didn't open. I still landed on my feet, though, and the dream continued. I decided to fly. I didn't realize that lucid dreaming takes practice, so I flew so slow. I was so confused. I'm much better at it now. I mastered lucid dreaming in college, tried all the things. Turns out, I basically just love flying. So now, anytime I achieve lucidity, I immediately take off and enjoy the view. Close second is breathing underwater, also very fun. Rewind things when they stop making sense. Dreams and movies shouldn't ignore reality or physics. I have a recurring lucid dream where I'm with one of my childhood friends, and he and I are walking through what looks like the campus of an Ivy League university in New England, both of us carrying a stack of books. He's just talking a mile a minute, worried to death about something, and I just sigh and say, You realize none of this is real, right? We're in a dream? He answers, What? No? What are you talking about? Watch, I say as I roll my eyes and chuckle. Then I sprint as fast as I can into a nearby brick building, and I bounce off the wall cartoon style. My friend's eyes go wide, and he looks around, and he runs into the wall too, and bounces off just like I did. We both start laughing uncontrollably, and other students are looking at us like we're nuts, and we start doing other things that aren't possible in real life, like running up walls and jumping over tall trees. Then, I wake up. Been having this dream for at least a decade now. I mastered lucid dreaming at a very young age, and at the time, I always had a lot of nightmares. A lot of my nightmares were mostly the same, to the point where my mother woke me up one time, and I said, it was one of those damn dogs with light bulb eyes. And she replied, I haven't that one in a while. In these dreams, I would know I was dreaming and know what was going to happen, but couldn't control myself. Realizing that as a kid, in other lucid dreams, I would practice all night long. I made a chant kind of thing to help me out of my dreams. I'd go to sleep, lucid dream, chant, and wake up, usually multiple times a night. I'm 18 now, and I can recognize when a dream is a nightmare, only by a few seconds in dream time, and can tell myself to wake up. No chant needed. I have lucid dreams all the time, and I've always wondered why people are so fascinated with them and why they want to have them. I'll qualify this by saying I'm one of those folks that has vivid dreams every night, and I always remember. I often go to the same places and see the same people in many of my dreams, all of which aren't real, and for as long as I can remember, so 35 plus years. Lucid dreaming isn't, oh shit, I'm dreaming I can fly, like most people think it is. It's more a test of concentration. You simply can't control everything. Your brain has created this landscape, and you know it isn't real, but you have to focus to change it. And that focus isn't necessarily easy to place or control. So sure, I can fly, but I don't know how flying is going to feel, or exactly what I'll be looking at. Sure, I can look at a beautiful spot on the ocean, but that isn't to say there won't be a sinking ship or a drowning child or whatever. And if I concentrate to change that, I might fall because I'm not worried about flying anymore, and so on. So I'd say think long and hard before you make an attempt. You'll almost certainly be disappointed. Knowing it's a dream doesn't make it better, any more than knowing something is temporary doesn't mean it sucks any less right now. It's also absolutely exhausting. I'm constantly exhausted from dreaming even when they aren't lucid dreams. I would give about anything to be able to sleep and remember nothing when I wake up. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it, dislike if you disliked it, and subscribe so you don't miss our next upload.